So, race 26, now last race of the day. And the last race here from Far Hills, which is a shame. So, it's a three mile and a half, a furlong novice hurdle, Jinka Trail for Marty Needham, Sunning Eye for Darren Thompson, Atonement and Fire for Joshua Sutherland, Hidden Persuader for Leon Van Rensburg, Arlington Killer for Vinnie Gerard, Bessophilus. Bucephalus idea for David Robertson, Pretty Ears for Craig Beckwith, Prince Sense for Alex Cherry, and Twinkle Toes for Stu Gray makes up ten. Let's go over this exciting course here at Far Hills. And disqualifications, horses falling at the last. It's been a bit of a crackerjack. Flags dropped, they're away. Over this three miles, let's see if we have the same sort of excitement. Wait for that final fence. Fury. They swing left-handed. It's pretty ears reluctantly leading us. And wide is atonement. As you can see, a couple of them are going to shuffle over. So it's a route. It's pretty ears that leads us. Great bet with blue silks, white sleeves, and a white cap. Happily bowling along. And the remainder, which we're pretty much together. It's going to hold again now, pretty ears. Get to the first of the 15 flights, everybody's over it. It's pretty ears that still leads us. Again, a great course here. This one's been done by uh, Graham. This is one of your really good courses. I'm impressed. But back to the racing. It's a novice hurdle. We had the two great events uh, finishing some spectacular styles. Last two. It's pretty years that leads us here by about four or five to even persuade her and fire together up against the fences. Prince Sense and Ireland, no, not going to kill it. Jinka Trow, Ireland to kill it, killers the green silks. And then the four at the rear, up, a sunny eye, twinkle toes, Bucephalus idea, and atonement. As they finally get to the second hurdle, we'll skip over that or jump at the rear by Bucephalus idea into the third. He was over it. This is the rest. And pecked a little bit was atonement. Towards the rear in the uh, black and red silks of Josh Sutherland. We get to the fourth. I'm over that as well. I thought you could fall at these fences. Let alone make a mistake. About as high as a matchbox. But it's pretty eyes that leads us here by about five. Darlington Killer and moved into second. Fire is third. Hidden Persuader in the blue silks. Yellow cap of Liam Van Rensburg is fourth. Then you've got Prince Scent for Alex Cherry. Alongside a Jinka Trail up against the fence. Only grey in the race is Twinkle, well not Twinkle Toes, they're only grey in the race is uh, Sonning Eye. He's got Twinkle Toes on his outside, Bucephalus Idea on his inside. Atonement widest of all. So pretty ears, taking a hold again. Still got uh, just under two miles to travel. Well, we'll go over that, a couple of poor jumps by Bucephalus Idea and Hidden Persuader as they shuffle towards the rear. But pretty eyes, ears. Still leads by about three. Tarlington Killer that's moved into second on his own. Good jump there by the leader. Must have over it. Tarlington Killer, as I said, in second. And they're about three or four away from chasing pack. Who's just being led by Fire and Prince Sense at the moment. As I swing left-handed again. And for another circuit. It's pretty years that leads us by two to Arlington Killer. Three or four back to Fire and Prince Sense. Wide as atonement. Got Jinka Trow and the Martin Leedham Silks, Cerise and Yellow Cap. Go over the seventh, they'll take that well. Better jump at the rear by Sunning Eye, the Grey. Get to the eighth, over that as well. So we've another seven flights to take. Here's Pretty Ears that leads us. We'll stream over that one as well. So Pretty Ears by three to Arlington Killer. A couple back to Atonement, Prince Sense and Fire. Bucephalus idea. Jinka Trail's moved off the route. Hidden Persuader. Just the two that are about three or four deeper. Sonny Eye and Twinkle Toes. We've all let this pretty ears go on his own. Arlington Killer's taken another hold now. Drops back to the chasing pack. So we've still got over a mile to travel and five to take. It's pretty ears that still leads us by about three or four now from Arlington Killer and Atonement together. And that links back to Fire and Prince Sense. Be pushed along in the rear now is Twinkle Toast, the Stu Gray, Black Silk's Green Sash. Didn't expect it to come anywhere amongst this lot as they all go over the tenth. The one that went through the top of it was Atonement. But they've shortened the lead now. Pretty Ears only got a two length advantage from Arlington Killer and Atonement. We get to the eleventh. We'll take that bet up. 
pretty ears, just by a length now, to Ireland some killer in second, Tony is third, fire is fourth, moving well on the outside now is the grey, Sunny Eye looking for a bit of rainer, racing room, Prince Sense just on his inside, Ginger Trail hasn't asked for anything, hidden persuader, what's the this idea? at the rear couple of lengths off the pack is Twinkle Toes. So up front Pretty Ears put under a bit of pressure now as we come inside the five. Pretty Ears from Arlington Killer as they go over the twelfth. So we're just three to take. It's Arlington Killer that just noses in front now as we go over the thirteenth. Better jump there. One that jumped really well was Hidden Persuader and making up a little bit of ground and coming right out of the pack for Leon Van Rensburg as they get to the fourteenth. It's the penultimate with just one to jump and four furlongs to travel. It's Arlington Killer and Hidden Persuader. Doesn't look like uh, Sunning Eye has got a lot left. Both of his ideas trying to push out of the pack as well as fire. But it's the Arlington Killer that's holding off all challenges with Hidden Persuader just on his outside. Bus of his idea, fire and sonning eye. I don't think anything else is going to get into this, but it's Arlington Killer that still leads. Got the route to help us. They swing left handed inside the final quarter mile on two furlongs. It's Arlington Killer. Hidden Persuader just noses ahead. Here comes fire, sonning eye, the great trying to run on, but it's Hidden Persuader that takes it up inside the furlong. We've seen what happened to Leon Van Rensburg's hooks on the last, but it's Hidden Van Persuader. Can he get over the last? Come Arlington Killer, but here comes fire. They're challenging him now at the last. Better jump by fire, and fire's got away from it. Arlington Killer gives way, it's fire and hidden persuader, but Atonement on the outside and Atonement gets up. Atonement's going to take this from probably Arlington Killer in second. Hidden persuader and uh, fire just dropped away towards the end there. Don't think it's a one two for Josh. I think he's going to have his horses separated by Arlington Killer. He is, so Atonement takes it. Wins the Far Hill Novices Hurdle, our last race of the day from Arlington Killer in second. Josh Sutherland got up for third with Fire. And fourth was Leon Van Rensburg's Hidden Persuader. And Sonning Eye for Darren Thompson was fifth. We'll see you all tomorrow.